Hello once again ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of NRK Plays Plague Inc. Evolved. Um, today I was going to do the scenario Who Cares, but uh, this game was recently updated and four new scenarios were added. So I'm going to start from the top and do these four, and then I'll go back to uh, Who Cares and Xenophobia. So let's start with Artificial Organs. So Artificial Organs says... Rapid advances in medical science allow for the production of advanced artificial organs. As production ramps up, it is hoped that the new ability to replace organs will significantly improve life expectancy. Is humanity on the brink of immortality? Alright, so what, sh what plague shall I do? To wipe out our immortal humans. I might actually go nanovirus... Alright. Looking pretty good. So, as you can see from the update, um, cheats have been added uh, that you can use with your plague. I'm not going to use any cheats, but I will do a, a video later on um, testing out these cheats. So, stay tuned for that. Going to be calling this... Artificial Plague Welcome to Artificial Organ Scenario. Advanced advances in technology have developed which significantly reduce lethality of disease of uh, Yes. <laughs> Alright. So I've also noticed a couple of things. Um before I did not know this, but the plague starts on the date that your computer is set to. So, I didn't even know that. I probably should have noticed that. It's something that I probably should have noticed, but I didn't. So, yeah. So. I'm going to upgrade that uh, ability there just because the cure is already at 22% and I need to knock that down. Cure is crazy fast. Alright, so I'm gonna grab a transmission and hopefully I'll have enough to get the second cure resistance feature just to help me um, pretty much get around. So as you can see, the girl's already 50%, so that's pretty brutal. I need some medicine resistance. That's pretty much all I can do. So that dropped the cure back to 30%, which is good. Alright, um... I'm gonna grab water. Kiss a kiss. That's all I can do. Just kind of want to spread it out of India and get it moving because at the moment the cure is the only thing that's kind of destroying me um, because I'm not really moving that fast. So I really need to slow it down. Cold resistance and cure one. Hopefully that'll slow it down a little. Doesn't look like it's done much, but still, it's better than not having anything. Alright. So we've spread to UK. Oh, we've spread a little bit more now. Alright, so here we go. We're spreading around now. So the kill's going a bit faster. Genetic hardening too. Hopefully that'll help slow the cure. Hopefully. Alright, so the 
kill's gonna spurt in a second and go really fast. Simply because I'm in more than one country now, it's gonna be a little bit chaotic. Just gonna try and um, hold that down a bit. Alright, so maybe I'll upgrade the second one. Medicine 2. Maybe a little bit more transmissions, just to help the sick get sicker. Okie doke. Alright, so I'm going to upgrade Bird just to help it travel a bit quicker because at the moment it's just not really traveling that fast. Oh boy, I almost missed that one. Alright, so as you can see, Bird has helped us travel across land borders quickly, so that's going to help me out a little. Alright, so we're starting to travel a bit quicker, which is good. Increasing infectivity in wealthy countries sounds good. Um, slowing future broadcast sounds good. Alright, so I'm gonna upgrade blood as well. Hopefully, that'll help us spread through the poorer regions quickly. And we can actually spread fast. So, skin lesions have mutated, which is gonna help us get to. Um, Necrosis. Right, places are shutting down their ports now, which is troublesome. Red bird two, insect two, and sneezing. All right. So hopefully we can get to all the countries that are concerning. So I'm killing people now, so I don't want that. So hopefully I can get into Greenland. Hopefully. I'm mutating quite a bit. Um... Still haven't gotten into Greenland. Everywhere is infected except Greenland. Their, pu their ports are open, so are Russia's, so just send a boat to Greenland. <laughs> there we go. Alright, so now I can start killing people. Alright, so I've upgraded Insanity, Necrosis, and... What was the last one I upgraded? Hemographic Shock. So that means that it's going to pretty much... Um, Kill people. Pretty quickly. Artificial organs to save lives. Hyper advanced artificial organs are replacing organs damaged by artificial plague. Factories worldwide are rushing to produce more. Okay. Victims of artificial plague rip out organs. People with artificial organs are violently rejecting them, leading to horrific deaths. It appears that artificial plague triggered the insanity. Oh, okay. So upgrading insanity really, really helps with, um, with this scenario. That's cool. Alright, so... I've made people rip out their own organs. It's kind of messed up. Alright, so I highly suggest upgrading insanity to this scenario. So let's just go crazy on the symptoms now. Okay, or maybe I'll just upgrade too.
Alright. So I've almost wiped everyone out. So their artificial organs didn't help them at all. I'm assuming if you don't upgrade... Well, this is a different screen. Artificial plague has successfully eliminated all life on Earth. Alright, cool. So as you can see, the updates added a couple of new things. Um, there's more scenarios now, so I've got some more scenarios to uh, do for you lovely people. Um, I'll be doing the other three and then the last two in the next couple of videos. And yeah, and then I might do might uh, show you guys the cheat plague, the new ones. Alright, so if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like, favourite, share this around, and uh, just have a fantastic day, you lovely, lovely people.